Hey guys, welcome to Helpful Solutions Tutorial and this is a Time Doctor Tutorial and I'm going to show you a step-by-step -step on how to track your time. So guys, Time Doctor will help you increase productivity by providing insight and how the time is spent. And guys, also Time Doctor can report project or task and track the total time spent on different projects. So guys, first thing you have to do is go to timedoctor.com and then from here this will be their homepage. so guys time doctor has almost 250,000 time doctors users so guys they are a well-known platform and first thing you have to do guys is go over here to start trial so from here guys you will have an option to sign up into your email or sign up with your google but i'm gonna go for my google from here guys it's gonna ask you what's your top challenge we'll have four options here productivity wellness time tracking and attendance payroll and billing so i'm gonna go for productivity what's your company size so i'm gonna go for the lowest which is 1 to 25 and then from here who owns the computers that your team works on so I'm going to go for the team members. And then from here, guys, you will have an option to invite your team right away. So we're going to input the email address over here for my team. And then once you have provided their email, guys, and then you will have an option here on their access level. They can be an admin or a manager. So I'm going to go for William Ross as a manager and I'm going to put Danny Beast as a user. And also, guys, you can add more if you like or you can add more if you have more team in your company. And we're going to go for send invites. So from here, guys, you can get $100 off when you provide your card. But as of now, we're going to go for no thanks. So guys, this will be their dashboard. And as you can see here, right away, you will have a tutorial on how to download Time Doctor and inviting users. So if you scroll down, guys, you will have here the overview of the total time track of each employee or the total manual time, total mobile time, the total unproductive web and app usage. I think this feature is really helpful for the people who are inactive and over here lastly we have the active users and guys we can have an option here widgets so from here on the widgets you can toggle a lot of things like the hours track or if you want to remove it just uncheck the box and guys widgets are only available when at least seven days are selected and we have a lot of options here to untoggle and next up we have here the top project and you can manage project over here right away so guys when having a project you'll have here archive project or an active project so guys let's try to add a project so from here you will have an option to who have access to your project so it can be everyone in the company or a specific group or a specific people so let's say i'm gonna go for everyone in the company and i can name here our project the project x let's say and then we're gonna click on save and then from here guys you can have an option to add a task for the people to see and hit this save button and now you will have here the project, you guys. So you can list many tasks as you want. And now, guys, let's go back to our dashboard. So from here, let's scroll down, guys. So we also have a trends over here. So when we click it here, our track report, you will see here all of the people who time in on your company. And at the very top, guys, we have here a filter option. It can be a day, it can be a week, or it can be a monthly. And now, guys, let's go back to our dashboard again. So let's scroll down, guys. 
So they also have here the productivity percentage. So from here, guys, there will be a chart on how everything is going on your business. But as of now, since we just created our account, it is not yet showing. And now, guys, let's move on to the next one. We have here the top users. So from here, guys, you will have the top users that are working on your business. So I think this is a good feature as well because this will motivate some people to be on the top. So there will be a little bit of competition. So guys, your employee will get motivated to work more. And right here, they also have the highest time on productive website and apps. And they also have here an option, the highest time on unproductive website and apps. So you will see here the people who are unproductive on their time. And then down below, we also have the track most hours and the track least hours and also the highest of idle minutes and the highest of manual and mobile time so i think this block is really helpful guys for you to see the performance of each users so if we scroll down guys we also have here website and application so you can watch this video over here for a more detailed tutorial on how to use and utilize website and application and now guys let's scroll up so over here at the top we have a report so we can have an activity summary attendance our struck project and task timeline web and app usage custom export and unusual activity so now guys let's go to attendance over here so here on the attendance you will see here the user's status, the shift start time, time in and time out of each users. So guys, you can also have here an option to set up work schedule. So when you want a person to work, just click over here, add shift. And then from here, you will have an option which time he will clock in and which time he can clock out. And from here, you will have an option to have a required hours for her or him to do the task and you can just hit save to add a schedule and next up guys we have here the screencasts and we also have an edit time and on the settings we also have the billing the project and task settings the productivity ratings the users the groups the email notification the integrations company settings work schedule and lastly the break and now guys let's try to go to the billing so guys here on the billing we are currently using a plan that is premium so if we click over here so from here guys we will have an option to pay annually or pay monthly so for the monthly we have the seven dollar which is a basic one and down below you will see here the description about this subscription and then we also have the standard and we also have the premium one which will cost you 20 dollars per month and guys when you pay annually you will get two months for free and next up guys we have the payroll as well over here so on the payroll you will see here the total payment of each employee and it will automatically generate their payroll based on their total time of work and there you go, guys. If this video is helpful, please like and subscribe. And thanks for watching. See ya.